Barcelona preparing a surprise transfer. Manchester United are getting close to signing De Jong. The Sagas of Mane and Darwin Nunes are now connected directly. And Laporta called Lewandowski's agent. All these and more awaits you in today's video. Let's get the show on the pitch. Barcelona have made a bid for Shakhtar Donetsk right back Dodo. However, the miners want to receive at least 20 million euros. According to El Chiringuito, Atletico Madrid have contacted Gareth Bale over possibly joining them on a free transfer this summer. According to Mundo Deportivo's Gabriel Sanz, Clement Langley has got offers from Porto and Tottenham Hotspur. Barca? I can't say anything right now. I'm currently focused on the national team and after we will see what happens. Bernardo Silva said, Before completing the Chuamani transfer, Real Madrid were interested in Sandra Tonali. Asensio's contract at Real Madrid expires in 2023 and it's not excluded that he will want to complete it, goes Jorge Picon reports. The club intends to sell the winger if they cannot reach an agreement over an extension. Matteo Alemani will meet today with Ivan de la Peña to close Gavi's contract renewal. Newcastle are ahead of Milan in the race for Sven Botman. The Italians will attempt to sign Glazen Bremer. Real Madrid and Man City are interested in Chelsea defender James. Madrid have stepped up interest in him recently. Barcelona and Juventus are competing for Il Kai Gendouan, according to Tutasport. Mosalach won PFA Premier League Player of the Year, while Phil Foden got the Young Player of the Year award. Barca are ready to pay Gavi 2 million euros a year, while Liverpool are offering 9 million. The footballer asks for 4 million with a further increase. Manchester United are keen to take Darwin Nunez from Liverpool, though the striker wants to participate in the Champions League. I've discovered the city of Paris. I lived this first year at PSG with a lot of emotions, Messi claimed. A possible pay cut? It's not the best decision to do it through the press. It's always better to talk face to face, Marca quotes Sergio Busquets. PSG entered the history of the Championship of France. No one has won more titles than we have. This is an important moment in the history of the club, Mbappe told the PSG press office. Chelsea are set to loan Lukaku for 25 million euros and buy Gabriel Jesus from Manchester City instead. De Jong brings extra qualities with him. That's why I believe he's worth 112 million euros. Lee Van Gaal thinks. Roberto took a salary cut from 12 to 5 million euros a year before Texas in order to stay at Barca. Ronaldo is a machine. I think the stats can speak for themselves. Hopefully, we can stay with him for many, many years. Diogo Delata wished. This team is filled. Winning five Champions League in the last eight years has only one definition. Making history, Casemiro noted. Chelsea are open to bids for Werner and Ziyech, while Pulisic can also leave the Blues. Besides, negotiations with Inter over Lukaku are underway. Chelsea are eyeing Sterling, but there is also interest from Real Madrid, Barca and Bayern. Manchester City will ask for 50 to 60 million pounds for their star winger. I was like little shivers to Messi talking. Everyone shuts up. They are all like that, whoever it is. Manager, president of Argentina, whoever is there. They just shut up. Amy Martinez shared. I'm going back to being player I was. I'll return in my top shape, Eden Azar promised. Harry Keane called Italy one of the favorites for the 2022 World Cup, but Mancini's squad did not even qualify for the tournament. Incidents at the Champions League final? This is obviously a failure. The image of the country has been shaken. I'm well aware that people in good faith were aghast. I'm sorry, but there was no other way, stated Paris police chief Didier Lallemain. Only one out of every four tickets given at the Champions League final was authentic. 60% of fans gathered at the Stade de France with no tickets. The son of former Liverpool owner Gillette, Foster Gillette, will become the majority shareholder of Olympique Lyon. The transaction amount is about 600 million euros. Liverpool announced Divock Origi's departure. Thank you for an incredible eight years of service, legend. Karius also left the club. I feel at times I've played a bit safe at City, but when I come to England team, I feel a lot more freedom," Jack Grealish admitted. Alexander Lacazette came back to Lyon after a five-year spell at Arsenal. His contract is until 2025. 
Leeds defensive midfielder Calvin Phillips is about to turn down Manchester United due to rivalry between the teams. Man City are soon to make him an offer. Messi starred in the Argentine TV series Los Protectores. The episode with La Fuga is going to be released in 2023. I only considered Madrid or Chelsea. A club like Madrid doesn't call many times. They are used to winning. Marca quotes Rüdiger. Another bunch of Nation League games took place yesterday. The results are in front of you. Moving on to the main topics of the release. Let's have a brief rewind of yesterday's fixtures. In the League B of the Nations League, Norway had a shutout with Slovenia, 0-0. Serbia defeated Sweden thanks to a winning goal from Javic, 0-1. As for League A, Portugal smashed Czech Republic 2-0, with Cancelo and Guedes securing the victory for the Navigators. Spain withstanded Switzerland 1-0. Sarabia succeeded in an accurate shot in the 13th minute. Orly and Chamonix will move from Monaco to Real Madrid. According to journalist Fabrizio Romano, Real Madrid and Monaco have already signed all the necessary papers. Chamonix is soon to undergo the final part of his medical checkup for Madrid right after the Nations League France vs Croatia fixture scheduled on June 13th. The 22-year-old only has to sign a contract with Los Blancos. In case all the bonuses are activated, the transfer of Relian could cost the Marengis 116 million euros. PSG's budget for the summer transfer campaign is 80 million euros. According to L'Equipe, the Red and Blues can now spend 80 million euros on newbies, but the budget could increase if the Parisians decide to sell one of their own players. What's more, 35 million euros have already spent on the purchase of defender Nuna Mendes from Sporting. Mbappe is probably unhappy with the matter, as he was promised a significant bolstering of the squad. Liverpool expect Bayern to lay out more than £40 million for Sadio Mane. The English club believes the winger, whose deal with Liverpool lasts until the summer of 2023, is totally worth more than £40 million, according to The Telegraph. The leadership of the Reds is convinced of Bayern fulfilling the necessary requirements. Moreover, they plan to use the proceeds from the sale of Mane to purchase Benfica forward Darwin Nunez. As soon as Sadio's departure to Bayern gets completed, Liverpool will make an offer for the 22-year-old star. Liverpool have reached an agreement with Darwin Nunez. According to The Athletic, the Reds and the Uruguayan have agreed on the terms of a personal contract. Still, Liverpool have not yet reached a compromise with Benfica over the player's transfer cost. The Portuguese side wants a total of about 100 million euros. The parties are negotiating the structure of the deal. Benfica have a desire to receive 80 million euros up front and another 20 million in bonuses. Barcelona doesn't mind let their midfielder Frank de Jong join Manchester United. The English team is offering 60 million euros for the 25-year-old midfielder and another 20 million as bonuses. As Marca writes, the management of the Blaugrana considers the offer too profitable to refuse. Moreover, Barca bosses are rather convinced that there will be no better offers for any other footballer on the roster, with the exception of those whom the club is not going to sell. The management of Barcelona is pleased with Robert Lewandowski's will for a transfer. According to Sport 1D, citing sources close to Barcelona, a few days ago, Catalan club president Joan Laporta called strikers agent Pini Zahavi and thanked Lewandowski for his public statements regarding Bayern. Joan Laporta would like Barcelona to sign Milan forward Rafael Liao, reports Cadena Cope. However, the Barca president admits it would be too complicated to land the 22-year-old. Firstly, Milan plan to extend Liao's deal. Secondly, his estimated value is 70 million euros. Nevertheless, Laporta has already discussed the potential deal with Liao's agent, Jorge Mendes. Friends, don't forget to give new videos from our other projects a try. And that was Football News. Have a nice one and see you in a bit.